Welcome back to the channel. Um, thanks for stopping by. Um, I wanted to do a quick video about the extra piece that it says, I'm not a part of the rig, I'm the shipping uh, bodyguard that comes with this spin twist. And um, utilizing this to kind of make a drying um, station. So I want to talk about this real quick. Um, I went to Lowe's and I got these one inch die cut zinc compression conduit fitting um, pieces um, for electronics. Um, item number 72222. I think it was, I have it written down here, $2.08. Um, and basically, they fit, they fit these um, pieces that you get with your spin twist to um, put finish on your instrument or what have you. So what I did was is I bought these four um, compression conduit um, fittings and basically used just a one and a quarter um, bit to make the hole work for this unit. And then I needed to, we needed to thin this um, extra board down just by half so that you could screw up the, um, this fitting with a one and seven eighths, one and seven eighths, one and seven eighths. So basically that gives you your hole, you screw on the, the conduit thing. Well, if you guys have ever messed with electrical stuff, that's, it's a, you know, it's a lot of fun. Um, however, I did put a little dab of super glue around that um, locking mechanism just so that it doesn't jiggle loose. Kind of helps lock that into place. So, yeah, you can turn this I'm not a part of the rig, I'm the shipping bodyguard, into a staging unit for drying. I also cut up a couple more pieces just to reinforce, I haven't attached them yet obviously, but you can put these in and actually reinforce further this unit, so if you're sitting it on the ground. So there you are, you know, you're painting your thing and then when you wanna take a little break, Shabam. Just like that. Let it sit, let it do its thing. And then pull it right back out. So anyway, I thought it was just a quick and easy little fix that allows you to have a staging area. Again, a one inch die cut zinc compression conduit fitting. I will have the part number or link to it. I bought mine at Lowe's, but um, I'll have that part number. I will have that part number in the description so that you, for a couple bucks, can recycle, if you will, not have to get rid of this shipping bodyguard and turn it into a, uh, yeah, turn it into a drying station for a couple bucks. Anyway, that's all I got. Thanks for stopping by. Um, any other ideas or what maybe you've seen work? Hey, put them in the comments. There's gonna be a lot more to come. So like, subscribe. I love it when I say smash, smash it. Smash, smash. Anyway, um, yeah, like, subscribe. I appreciate it. Have a great week. See you again soon.